speak to a Washington County judge about how that district is preparing for the conditions and they talked a little bit about the ice brine and laying it on the roads. The question is, why does this help? Well, we're explaining the science behind salt brine. First, understand when water is in its liquid state, like rain, the molecules are loosely packed. Whenever water reaches the freezing point of 32 degrees or below, molecules are then packed more tightly. Now on roads, this causes a big problem. Wet, icy, and slushy roads reduce traction between your car's tires and the road surface. So if you hit ice, your car could suddenly go into a skid, which is a scary situation. That's why we need to break up these molecules to limit ice or slush on the roads. Now salt or brine solution does not necessarily melt ice or snow with increased heat. It merely brings the freezing point of water to a lower temperature. At the molecular level, the salt molecules get in the way of the bonding water molecules, helping it not to freeze. The regular freezing point of water is 32 degrees. Adding sodium chloride lowers that freezing point to 15 degrees, using science to make us a little safer.